started our night off with a few cocktails by the beach, just before all of the craziness of the full moon party began. Although I'm sure you'll find some big strong men to look after you and you'll be fine for the night. <laughs> <laughs> it's so much bigger than last night. Yeah. It's so like... So we just got here. <laughs> we have some German friends with us. We're hoping our camera doesn't get robbed here. We'll see. And yeah, we're heading to the bar first and then down to the beach. Boom. Yeah, we were also told to wear shoes to the beach because there's a lot of broken glass down there. So I'm wearing my shoes. Irish don't give money to Germans. Mine Germans give money to Irish. You prick. Full moon party was great. We yeah, it was totally better than anticipated. Surpassed expectations. We're definitely going to do a video on tips about the full moon party. So keep your eye out for that. We're just going to continue on to our story from yesterday, uh, which if you've been following is uh, quite the interesting one. And we'll also have some really exciting news after we finish this story for tomorrow. To refresh, we decided to backpack. We went, we went from Ireland to Bangkok and we got to passport control and there was a problem with Shane's passport. So I'm there basically just getting drilled by Thai immigration. It really looked like a full-on interrogation. So Kel was on the other side of passport control. Uh, it's only like 20 feet away. But it really felt like we were miles and miles apart. It felt like I was so far away from him. Yeah, I hadn't a clue. Like I'm, I traveled to the US, Canada, Dubai. I'd been to Thailand on his passport. Like but They were really adamant that he'd never been to Thailand before with his passport. I had. You had? Yeah. They wouldn't let me back here to see him. If Dublin confirmed that Shane was who he was, who he said he was, then they would let him in. Or 12 midday, sorry, in Thailand at the time which would mean it'd be like 4 or 5 a.m. in Ireland. So obviously nobody's working, nobody's on the phone, so they can't communicate with them. So Thai immigration suggested to Shane that the Irish immigration bring, the Irish embassy, sorry, bring him um, an emergency passport. One problem with that. Ireland, unlike other countries, nearly every country that we've checked, their emergency passport isn't for 12 months, it's for 14 days. The problem with that is that the Thai immigration issue a 30-day tourist visa. So you can't issue a 30-day visa on a 14-day passport. <sighs> Thai immigration have tried, but due to what's happened, we're gonna get deported. Back to Ireland. So they cancelled my visa and they let me back through. Can I say something that I forgot to fin Finally, it didn't feel like we were miles apart anymore. Huh? That's a bit corny. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, we leave it in. So basically we get put back with uh, the airline staff, we're now in their responsibility. We're going to tell you more about that because they were, again, they, 
they were pretty pretty terrible at their job it kind of brought us further down the rabbit hole for this mad story uh, definitely uh, subscribe is it there yeah somewhere along there subscribe so you can get notifications tomorrow's video is going to be really 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 exciting it's a Thai new year here celebrate by having a huge water fight a relentless <laughs> water fight so that video I think is going to be really really epic we got some really really good uh, plans in store for it so do check it out it's definitely going to be our best one today. Trevor Tracy got me earlier now we're even. <laughs>